What's the crack, lads? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're taking a look at what's coming Monday, doing our Sunday preview. We already know up on the database the European Club Selection Guardian Pack is going to be coming. That is here as you're seeing it right there now. Ederson, Nuno Mendes, you also have Silva from Benfica, and there's a couple of other players over here. Sakaria is probably a player that a lot of people will definitely want to keep an eye on because he is a beast, one of the best GP players in the game, and now he's going to be getting another version of his card here. Depends what stats he has, we'll go into that in a second, but I do feel now that they are going to be winding down a little bit with the domestic leagues all finishing, the Champions League and all the European ties kind of finishing uh, over the next couple of weeks, um, and I do feel like that they're going to be adding a lot of new stuff for international uh, players and stuff like that with the Euros ongoing. They've already updated a lot of the kits with the last update. These are some of the stats that you're going to be seeing here. As you can see here, you've got Ederson. We also have Nuno Mendes. You have Hartman and so on and so forth with some of these cards. Zakaria is definitely going to be one I think is... I A lot of people will like him. I know that a lot of people like his standard card and he's had other versions as well. He's had a Chelsea version card that was really, really, really popular at the time. If you don't have right card, if you don't have Vieira... If you don't have one of the big boys, like 100 plus overall, I definitely feel that Zakaria is probably going to be worth a spin or two, but it depends on where you are with your squad at the moment. Calabria obviously is going to be rounded off there as well from AC Milan. Now, I know a lot of people are going to ask me as well, what other legends might come? Well, I'm going to be doing a video on the new legends that they've added to the DB, and there is some there is some nice cards, I think, coming, but I do feel like for eFootball 2025... I know it's early in the year. I know that we're still we're we're talking about eFootball twenty twenty five, and there's still a few months to go. You know the Euros hasn't even <laughs> hasn't even started, let alone finished. So I do feel they'll get a lot of cards out with the Euros and stuff like that, international uh, events. But I do feel that all eyes will probably feature on eFootball twenty twenty five when they add new legends, like these legends that you see here. There are a couple of new ones added. But this is from our friend CTE Football over on Twitter. Beckenbauer and Mataus have got new legend cards in the game, but they're not new legends. Lizarazu and Van Boyten, they're not new legends. They've featured before. Now, Philip Lamb in his first legend appearance here in eFootball as down as a right back, is down as a right back. Obviously, all of these cards are just predicted ratings. They don't have ratings. And I'll get into that in the legend video that I'm going to do because I want to talk about a couple of things of what I've kind of started to put together with the legends. It's going to be an interesting video. We'll get to that as well. But as I said, they have added a couple of new legends, such as those guys that you're seeing on screen there. And of course, we also do have a couple of the players like this, such as Lillian Toram, who they've added as well. So this is another mock-up, but he is in the database, a brand new Juventus card. Could he come Monday with the European selection? I don't think so. Personally speaking, I do agree with a couple of people on Twitter saying that it could be Michael Owen. A few people are saying that his card could come as well. I think that it would be a good shout. Honestly, I do feel like that Michael Owen would definitely be a good shout to come with the European selection, especially because it's a young version of him. I feel like when they bring out the European clubs, it's usually the cards, the legends that they add with them. It's usually cards that they don't have the license to, such as Figo at Real Madrid or you know, Makalele at Real Madrid or, or players like that. Um, so it is going to be interesting as to what does come. But we do know, as we said, we do know that this pack is going to be coming here. So that is uh, that is kind of like, you know, it is one thing that we know is going to be coming on Monday, which is the 22nd of April. So that's just it for me. Let's a quick video. Zakaria is obviously going to be a player that I think a lot of people will definitely want. Nuno Mendes as well, depending on his levels, it'll be interesting. But let me know what you guys think. Let me know what you're going to see Monday. We probably will have the Inter Milan pack as well Monday. I'm not 100% sure, but that event is starting soon. But let me know. We'll be back Monday with the reviews and a roundup of everything as ever. Until then, don't forget to subscribe. We'll talk to you then.